I am Dr. Shivraj. I am a consultant pulmonologist uh, working in Columbia Hospital, Whitefield. The COPD is normally what you used to tell like it is a irreversible disease. Once the person is labelled as a COPD, so he has to be there throughout his life. Until and unless if he stop the smoking, then even his lung capacities will be maintained. If he persistently smoking, it is continuously deteriorating. What will happen? The complications of the COPD normally, there is a chances of recurrent lung infections. It can lead to the lung pneumonias. And some patients, because if they persistently smoke, this COPD also may land up into also the tuberculosis. And also there may be the chances like a lung cancer also can happen. Because of COPD, this usually heart and lungs are interrelated. When the heart lungs is not working, it will put a pressure on the heart. So that reason what will happen, right heart will become weaker. So it will have the causing the right heart also become failed. Second is the pseudomonas infection. This is the pseudomonas is a very resistant bug. Usually this resistant bug always you should see in a people who are having a chronic lung disease. Like there is called the bronchiectasis in a patient with the COPD, in a patient with the cystic fibrosis. So this is one of the resistant organism. Usually many people, especially this chronic lung disease, are, so if they are not taken treatment properly for this pseudomonas infection, many times there will be colonization. When they become colonization, it's very difficult to eradicate. In that type of things, normally we used to call, there is called the inhaled antibiotics. Inhaled antibiotic like there is a tobramycin and the cholestin. This antibiotic the person has to use for 6 months to 8 months.